has been a busy week for unionization efforts here on the Hill. Good evening and welcome into News Live at 6. I'm Nicola Ponte. And I'm Chilla Cassiadele. SU service employees wanting in that union momentum mm -hmm. front and center for all of campus to see in front of the Hall of Languages today. Our reporter Tyler O'Dono was there this afternoon. Tyler, what else are these workers fighting for? Thank you, Chile and Nicole. Students and faculty gathered outside the Hall of Languages today to ask for higher pay for staff across campus and to fight for further unionization. I love my job, and I love my job enough that I'm willing to fight for it. I thank you my be well met. Thank you my Unity seemed to be the general theme today. This comes after graduate students had their first union contract ratified on Tuesday. Now, dining and library workers are also looking to establish a union to raise pay and benefits. We talked to one worker named Tara Slater, and she says her mother works at the university and helps put her through school. She wants to continue the tradition, but the pay just isn't being raised enough. We kind of waited for other things to happen on its own. I've been here nine years, and this 2% raise isn't raising. <laughs> so I do think we just need some more protection. And now despite their feelings regarding pay, the people I spoke to said they love the university and they want to continue working here. But they feel that what they're being offered just isn't enough. As for when this possible union could be put into place, they're currently gathering signatures in hopes for a vote later this semester. That's all for now. Back to you two with the desk.